Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to explore how bricks are traditionally made in my hometown. Let's get going. Now we're walking to the factories. These factories are more than 20 years old and they have been the main source of income for lots of families in the area. Every day the workers start working around 7 a.m. and finish the day around 5 p.m. The salary is from 7 to 9 dollars a day. Now let's delve deeper into the process of making bricks. First, an excavator will take the raw clay and mix it with water. Then the mixture will be covered by a big plastic blanket and sit there for two days so it can get softer. Once the raw clay is ready, the workers will cut it into small batches and place them in a puck mill. In here, the softened raw clay will be ground and become a thick clay paste. The paste then will go through a rectangular opening and be molded into long pieces which is cut by this simple tool made of steel wires. After that, the wet clay bricks are carried and placed in the sun in one or two days so they can dry. Once the bricks are dry, they will be moved into a three-story kiln nearby to be baked uh, for 48 hours. During this time, the workers will continuously stoke a fire beneath the kiln. Once the final products are done, they will have the red-orange color and will be loaded on a truck to the construction site. Each brick is sold for about 700 dong, which is about 3.1 cents depending on the demand. It is a labor-intensive process that is done by both men and women. <laughs> 